Hello and welcome to the video. This is Streamer Bot Tips number three. Today I'm going to be teaching you how you can utilize the first word setting in StreamerBot. So what is first words? First words is essentially a setting in StreamerBot that allows you to have an action played whenever someone types something for the first time in the chat. So for example, if someone comes into chat for the first time and says hello, you can actually have an action to edit a text source to say what they said or just welcome them in. So I have my OBS open here and we're going to create a new text source. And I'm going to call this first words. And we don't really need to edit this much, but uh, Let's make sure that we select the font, make it a little bit smaller so that it fits whatever it needs to fit and then say, OK, maybe select the font. Let's let's try uh, a random one. This this one. Yeah, why not? Let's let's choose uh, Bodoni. And that's how our text source done. So let's go into streamer bot and create the action. So as you can see, I've got these um, previous actions that I created from the previous videos. If I right click, add, and then call this first words, you can call it whatever you want to, so that you can identify it easily. And what we need to do is we actually need to grab the information from the user. So we have to add action and then go into Twitch and then say get user info for target. And then the source type is going to be the user because we're grabbing the information from the user that said something. So we've got their information and now we're going to have to edit OBS the the text source so that it actually represents we, we, we let's say we want to say welcome in so if i right click add action go to obs and then i just say set gdi text so now we're going to have to get the user's username so if we go to streamerbot wiki uh you can actually see all the variables that are used here as i mentioned in my previous video but what you can also do is if you go into streamerbot let's cancel this for a second we can actually go into settings and then under settings, we can go under events and then the first words. If you click on the question mark, you can actually see the variables that are available for the first words event. So percentage user percentage shows the user's display name. So if we go back into our action, right click, add action, OBS, and then set GDI text. And then we can just say welcome in percentage user percentage. Click on OK. And then we're not done yet we actually have to go back into settings and we have to give the first words an action and say first words select you can and then you can also auto reset cache so what auto reset cache means is how long does it last until it starts doing this again so remember first words it doesn't work when they said something for the second time and so on it only works for the first time they said something in chat so we can set this to 12 hours which is a default so now if we go back to the actions, we've got this all set up. So now this should work. So if I type in hello, uh, well, actually, let me go back into my OBS. So if I type in hello, it should say welcome in Zamaxi. There you go. And you can see at the bottom of my screen, on the bottom right, you can see that I typed in chat. So then we've got our welcome in. But what happens if we want to display their message, like to say user said whatever message they said? And you can actually do that in StreamerBot. So if we go in to uh, StreamerBot Wiki here you, and on chat message, you can see that the variable message is what is used to display uh, the message that was sent in chat. So if we go back into StreamerBot and then edit this GDI text to say, Percentage user percentage said percentage message percent. Then click on OK. So what I, what I need to do is I need to go into settings and then reset the uh, the cache. And then we're all good and set up. Uh, and if I say welcome to my streamer bot video, I don't know. And then there you go. So Maxi said, welcome to my streamer.bot video. And that's really it. That's all I've got to show you on the first words. So if you like my video, don't forget to like the video. And don't forget to subscribe if you want to see more of these videos in the future. I will be making more. Work is a little bit busy at the moment. But until then, thank you very much for watching. And I shall see you.
in the next one.